All right, welcome back. Frank says to wait for him in the garage out in the back. Eh? Last episode, we shot up a church. Job, Pretty crazy. Thanks, Luigi. Sarah's cooking. She's bringing something over. In this rain? <laughs> She's a good girl. I'll see you tomorrow, Luigi. What is up with his voice? That didn't sound right. Hey, Frank out back. Sure. Back in the day. When the I don't was really understand what my mission objective is right now or what we're doing here all i know is i can't be like a dog waving around my money <laughs> thanks for waiting tom but don and i had to go over last month's numbers again sure so what's the job i want you to help sam and Polly with the shipment we've got coming in tonight Good stuff. Straight from Canada. Where do you need me? Sam's gone to meet our friends from the north at a farm outside of town. Polly will oversee the trucks bringing the shipment into the city, but I want you to go with him. Be an extra pair of eyes. Make sure it all goes smoothly. Okay. Get the car from Ralphie and meet Polly at the warehouse. He's got heaters in case you run into any trouble. Sure, Frank. No problem. Good. Now bring the Canadian home safe, Tommy. There is already a case earmarked for the Don. So far, I'm really liking this game. It's actually... It's actually really good. Tommy's a very likable character. But I thought the same about uh, Vito and Joe in uh, Mafia 2. Oh look, I unlocked the hearse. Awesome. I'm never gonna drive that. Holly, you need a chill. Hey, hey! Watch it, pal! Just dry it out! Sorry. You know this place? Oh, uh, yeah. We've done a few pickups at the farm before. Don't worry. There ain't nothing but cow shit and shine out here. It's gonna be an easy few clams. I'm surprised I'm not driving. Boys, load up the trucks. Easy clams. Yeah, back. yeah, right. Yeah, let's make it quick. I got some place to be. Ah, uh, you see it, Sarah, later. Luigi's little girl, your night shift. <laughs> You're something else, pal. Protecting the girl's virginity one day and taking it the next. Lay off, Polly. Uh, he called on. us the... He called the I'm other guys kidding. rapists. <laughs> She's a good girl. You settle down, she'll straighten you right out. You're going home to a couch. <laughs> Now, I wonder what kind of stories she could tell about her old man, though. Luigi was a stone cold killer back in the day. I wouldn't know. You know, she's been helping out behind the bar since she was a kid. I bet she's seen and heard a few things. Probably knows more about our business than we do. She knows enough not to ask me too many questions. <laughs> That's good. She won't ever make a liar out of you. Christ. You ought to marry her just for that. God damn it. Sam should be waiting here, but I don't see him. Something smells off. Yep, it's a settle. Don't let your Pekka get all shriveled up. Probably just trying to get out of the rain. Or into the bootleg. <laughs> That'll wake him. He ain't coming. Okay. Let's go find him. That bastard is just three sheets, and I'm wrecking a new suit for nothing. I swear I'm gonna kill him. Here. Just in case Frank was right. I'm gonna go grab them boys, get them sorted out. 
You go ahead, see what's what. We'll catch up with you. I'm gonna switch guns just in case. Someone's been waiting here tonight. One quarter out of work. Unemployment stands at 25%. That's crazy. Missing farmer found dead. Not treated as suspicious. Aw, oh, come on. What kind of guy shoots a dog? A terrible guy, that's what. Yeah, this is already very sus. Hey, buddy. He's dead. Jesus. Drop your weapon. You first. We don't have time for this. Sorry, pal. Guess we're doing this the hard way. Okay, then. Get over here! I got a pin down! Oh, I got you, buddy. Come on. Let me get this third one tap. Nice. Is there a... This guy had a Thompson. I want to grab that. What am I- what else am I looking at? Uncle is happy that gift is on the way. This was a setup. Yeah, it seems like it. That kind of scared me for a second. This feels right. Bro. Judging by the shit that happened already. Wow! Well, it's me, Tom! Polly! What took you so long? Looking for Sammy? Did you find him? Nah, not yet. Just him. Canadian crew. Dollars to donuts to rest the face down in the dirt, too. Uh-oh. The cops, Tommy. Well, how would I know? They didn't show a badge. God, they didn't say anything. They must be in Morello's pocket. This bastard. He can't even let us have this one racket. Forget about it, Tom. We gotta find Sam and get out of here. Border Patrol. On. Okay, let's see. What are the what are all these, by the way? 
It's a cool, I guess. They gotta be cops from the border patrol. Fuck. They've come heavy, all right. Make lost having PD look like pussy cats. Why am I following Polly? He doesn't know what he's doing. Sam be hiding from us though. Oh, there's guys in here. Over here. Well, I'll punch the shit out of him. Oh, I don't want to punch the barrel. That wouldn't be good. What else am I looking for in here? This. Bureau of Prohibition. Cool. I haven't used the Thompson yet, so... There we go. That took care of those guys. I got shot again. Come on, fellas. Push through. Oh. Reload. 39. This guy's down. Good. Nice. Tommy gun's not that bad. I kinda dig it. Thompson's, yes. You boys stay here and watch our backs. Plug anyone who gets within a hundred yards. Except us. They're both standing right next to a red barrel. There you go. Sammy, oh Jesus, what have they done to you? I got cold. Is this where he dies? That's a lot of blood. Can you walk? No, no, I don't think so. Okay, 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 just hang on. I'll go get the truck, then we'll take you to the doctor. 
Hey, hey, you gonna make it, Sam? Tommy. If he makes it alive again, I'm gonna be a little impressed. Survived worse. Sure. Sure we are. Where'd all these guys come from? Send him down, Tom! I knew there was a reason for that red barrel to be there. What? Did I get all my health back? Oh my goodness. I'm trying. Give me the sample. You good? Why is he even up here? That's two guys taken out. Oh, he's still reloading. What the fuck? He got up behind me. Sarah, there is a first aid kit. Okay. This part's a little rough, but we can do it. I might just switch to my pistol. I need the accuracy right now. That accuracy that I talked about, it's not here. I need this. So what? Here, I have an idea. Hi. I think if I... He's gonna walk up the stairs right now. This run is much better. God damn it. I gotcha. Jesus, this is Jesus Christ. Where's the goddamn truck? Not here. Crap, we got cops. Well, I gotta defend you some more, Sam. How is he still alive? Hi. Oh god. I am hurting. I need ammo. Easy. Okay. Holly sure is taking a sweet ass time. Yeah. What a 
fucking massacre. How's Sam? Well, he ain't any worse. I'll go get him. Keep an eye out. Yeah, I just stand out in the open like that. Out. <laughs> I need the doctor, Molly. Yeah, I can see that here. Hang on. I got you. I got you. Okay. I swear this guy's gonna die. That's. Okay. He's been bleeding out for way too long. I'm gonna get you all patched up. Okay. Oh, what is that? Molly? We got more company. All right. Get in! I'm right here, Sam. There's some ammo, and a Thompson back there somewhere. When they pull in behind you, blast them to hell! Just don't let them get past us! Funny how slow these things are. That thing back there is huge. Where the hell did I find that truck? Uh. Okay, one down. Take him out, Tab. Let him have it. Got this truck hell. I so I gotta defend this fuck out of this thing. And I'm hurt bad. I wish I could fucking take him out faster, but it's a little hard. Oh, we are fucked. Oh, that's not right. Oh, that's not, that's not part of the story. What was I supposed to do there? The cops were eating bullets. Okay. Why are they still following us? Do I have to take out the driver? Why are they still on us? There we go. How's that guy still alive? Sam, how are you alive? Well, I can't move this thing any faster. Or I can't reload it any faster.
Now I gotta worry about my health here too. Still alive? I supposed to do there wasn't enough health I'm trying there you go there's more It's all up to me to... Molotovs. There we go. Again, how is he not dead? Sam, Sam, we made it. We're at the doctor's house. Three, I owe you. I mean, it'd be good if he didn't die, but shit, it makes no sense. We got an injured man out here. All right, bring him inside. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, I'll stay with Sam. You can take the truck back. Call it a night. No, I'll wait. The doctor already got his hands full. No sense of both of us breathing down his neck. Go on, Tom. We'll be fine. God, Tom is so okay. messed up here. Hey, you did good tonight. Drive to Sarah's apartment. Okay. Skip that drive. Once again, that's like the best feature I've ever... I've ever like had the pleasure of using in a... Uh, pretty much a game like this. More games need to implement that. Honey, I'm home. You're late. Dinner's cold. Get the fuck over it. I come back home and this is how you talk to me?
What just changed her attitude? I'm, I'm a little confused. What a supportive wife, though. What? Okay. You sure that's the right time to say that? Let's do one more mission. Bye. It came as soon as I got your message. I'm angry, so Tommy. Tommy. We have a mole, Tom. <gasps> no. It's me. Who? Oh. A mole. I was up all night driving myself nuts trying to figure it out. I started thinking maybe it's one of our guys. We aren't paying his fair share. Someone with a light wallet. Maybe looking to Morello for a new suit. Frank wasn't around, so I went to the safe to get the account books. To see who's getting cents on the dollar he's earned. What do you know? The books are gone, Tom. Frank. Uh-oh. We're gonna have to kill him? 50 years I've known him. It's probably because he tried drowning his fucking dog. And every buck we've earned, every dime we've paid out, it's all logged in those books. Frank hands those over to the feds, we're finished. Frank respects one person in this whole town, and that's you. This has got to be some kind of misunderstanding. I've been calling him all day. I went by his place. He's gone. His wife and kid are gone. Are you trying to escape the country or some shit so we don't kill him? But why? But yeah, but why though? I don't know. I'm sure he has his reasons. Maybe he's still smarting over the dog. Huh. But when you tried to drown. Yeah. He shot the dog too? After he wouldn't let me sink her. What the fuck? Done. I was a stupid kid, Tommy. But grudge or no grudge, we gotta get those books back. Shake down all our stories. See who knows what. When you catch up to Frank, you get those books. And if he doesn't have them on him, you make him tell you where to find them. After that. You do what we gotta do. Okay. Vincenzo's waiting for you with a clean Fucking car. crazy ass guy. Tommy. Tommer. I'll take this. What's up? Okay today, Tom. We gotta keep a lid on this, Tom. Start with Biff, but don't give him nothing. I got you a clean set of wheels. Thank you. Something special here, if you want it. guy has some muscle, though. Like, his arms are fucking... Frank sees a Lepara. He'll know. The old ways work. Okay. Skip that drive. Chinatown. Get out of the way. Tommy. 
What's the rumpus? Here's the rumpus. Heard any big news lately? Something that Don might want to know. Uh, depends. <laughs> What's it worth to you? 20 bucks. How about 40? All right, spill. The FBI is in town. They're getting something from Morello, but I, I don't know what. How'd you hear? Little Tony got some guy drunk in the black cat and drove him home. Heard a bunch of stuff, so he's the guy you want to see. Okay. Thanks. Always a pleasure, Tommy. Thank you for fuck out. Okay, there you go. So weird that I got a hold axe. Get him, boys. Okay. Nah. Nah, it's not. What's this about the guy you drove home who's with the feds? He came in for a drink, which turned into ten. He's hired muscle for some kind of safe house. Where? Oak Hill. Corner of Pine. He gave me ten bucks to drive him back and keep my mouth shut. That on that council of Gilates brokered some kind of deal between Morello and the FBI. They were all ready to sit tight on someone in there. Why the hell didn't you tell us? Tom, I did. I came in to see Frank straight away. He didn't tell the Don? No. No, he didn't. Tom, what's going on? <laughs> Don't worry about it. I'll take that. Frank. He's cheating on us with the, some other guys. What the fuck? Oh no, a tailing mission? That's a that's a low. Take me to those account books, Frank. That's a low on you two K. God, I hate tailing missions so much. It's not as bad as the racing mission, but this is the second worst. Real question is how far am I going to have to drive? Hopefully not too far. Gosh, it's so much fun, guys. I'm loving it. Nor does he appear to be carrying the weight of expectation. 
He's having a word with the umpire about something or other. What a strapping fellow. 6'2", 195 pounds. If the Lancers are to win here today, he's going to write himself into the record books. And boy, oh boy, what that would mean to the people of Lost Heaven after such a long time without glory on the diamond. All right, they've sorted out whatever was going on. Here we go then. In for the cannons, it's Patty Doherty. Smith is pitching the game of his life, but Doherty's a big man. If he can catch one, it could run, and with bases loaded, the cannons would have it. Hmm. Here we go. Doherty facing down Smith. a protest. Ball and strike. The big man thought he had it. Some speed on that ball. My goodness. It's fair to say Doherty looks a little spooked. He ah, was convinced shit. he had it. His body was the airport freak. Smith remains cool under pressure. Not a flicker. So is he actually trying to flee the face. country? I mean, that would make sense. Why am I listening to this shit? How do I turn that off? Oh, I don't know. Great. Are we almost there? As far as this airport. Oh, let's switch this right there. I'm blending with the grass with this car. That's kind of dumb. I would leave the country if I left the mafia like that. I think it's trying to tell us that they have guns. Okay. Can I go through here? Nope. I feel like this guy would snitch if he saw me. Cool, so he's offering him information to... Got a shotgun? Morello hasn't the honor to even show his face. For a rat like you? Nah. Get in the car. Oh. God damn it. I didn't know how to fucking do that. Why? Oh. These guys are cops. Ain't no way they're actually... Throw molotovs at me. 
Man. I need a pistol. I don't know why my guy has a fucking shotgun. Stupid choice. I don't know how I'm gonna fucking survive this with a goddamn shotgun. This shotgun's such a stupid option. The fa- It's just- I didn't know I was supposed to press Y to go through cover like that. Oh, this is even worse. Where am I into this game, by the way? <laughs> Choke this guy out. There we go. That actually worked out perfectly this time. Well, that guy's still looking this direction. I don't want to... There you go. Just like this. Boom. Tom. Frank. The Don sent me. I figured as much. I'm sorry it had to be you, Tommy. Anything you want me to tell him? I wish it could have shaken out better, but Morello finally came after me. It's okay. You can come out. Morello offered me a simple trade. The Don's account books for our lives and tickets out of this town. You hand the books over, you... I'm not so stupid, Don. They're safe. Morello is waiting for this. It's a key to a box in the Grand Imperial Bank downtown. I told Morello I'd hand it over after the plane was fueled and ready to go. His men were meant to fetch it before we left. I took care of him. Tell them to get on a plane. Go on, March. Alice, get aboard. Frank, you're coming with us. Not right now, honey. Just get buckled in. Tommy and I, we have some serious business to discuss. But Frank... Get on the plane, March. Listen to Frank. For Alice, for me. Get on the goddamn plane, please. 
like the guy, the pilot's just in the back with his hands up when I don't even give a fuck about him. Oh my god, just get on that fucking plane. <laughs> You've been paid yet? Oh, uh, there we yeah. go. Now you've been paid twice. You take the ladies wherever they want to go. Yes, sir. Thank you, Tom. Christ, Frank. Why didn't you ask us for help? I guess I just wanted out. One way or the other. I'm tired, Tommy. Tired of lying to my wife. Tired of checking under my car every time I take a Sunday drive. And tired of waiting for the dawn to put two in my temple. Fair. God damn you, Frank. Now Frank is possibly safe. Cool story for it, but like that, that mission was boring as shit. Oh, hold on, it's not even over yet. Good afternoon, sir. Hi. Where's the safety deposit boxes? With my colleague downstairs, sir. Thanks. See, he, the Patriot Act hasn't happened yet, so uh -huh. they're probably not super secure about banks yet. Keeping out of trouble, I hope. I need to access the deposit boxes for Frank Coletti. Ah, yes, Mr. Angelo? Uh, yeah. Mr. Coletti said it might be you who came, and to provide access. Please, follow me. I don't trust this. Got the books and covered my tracks. Salieri never asked any questions. In fact, apart from the funeral, I never heard him talk about Frank again. Who are those four? Once Frank, I'm guessing. It's probably, probably Frank and. His Frank and his daughter and his wife, I'm guessing. Let's just kill that guy. This is Frank. I see one. This is Frank. They just don't want to show me the goddamn tombstones. You're making my boys twitchy, Marku. Sergio and I just came by to pay respects. That's all. Known Frank a long time. Almost as long as you. He's a good man. Smart. Loyal. <laughs> Loyal to his wife. His kid above all else. There must be some kind of honor in that in you. Maybe. But I'm still looking at this headstone with okay, his little so girl's name the family. It's a hell of a thing. There 
There you go. Nice. Boring ass mission. Visiting rich people, 1933. Look at these houses. Big yards, white picket fences. It's the American dream, eh, Tommy? I suppose. Not for you? No, sir. I don't like being closer to the business. Don't let the flower beds and front porches fool you. There's more criminals out here than in the rest of the city combined. Is that why we're in the neighborhood? In a way. Morell's got a dirty prosecutor on his payroll named Watkins. Turns out he's old friends with Galati. The city councilor? The same. Morell let drop that we might have had something to do with the Galati boy's death. Now Watkins is loaded for bear, trying to do right by his buddy. Word is, he's striking gold with a few witnesses. You have names? Yeah. But Paulie and Sam are taking care of them. I'm putting you on a different part of the job. We need whatever Watkins has got on us. Then where's he holding? A safe in his villa. <laughs> I'm no safe cracker. <laughs> Don't worry about that. We're taking you to meet Salvatore. He's fresh off the boat, but he knows how to pop open anything. Just get him into the villa, find the safe, and he'll do the rest. What kind of rumpus should I expect? Nothing you can't handle. Watkins is going to the theater, so the house should be empty except for a bit of muscle. The office is on the first floor, and our stoolie says the safe is in the wall. Once Salvatore has the safe open, grab all the evidence and get out. That him, boss? Yeah, that's our guy. Salvatore, tutto bene? Si, grazie. Don Salieri. Good to see you. You know the job. Don't let me down. Si, o capisco. Tommy, if you bump into Watkins, don't kill him. It'll just bring down more heat. You got it, boss. Buona fortuna, ragazzi. Tommy. Tommy Angelo. Piacere di... di conoscerti. Meraviglioso. <laughs> Pi favori. What's me a drive? Screw you. Oh yeah, um, okay. you know what, I'm gonna end it right here, uh, so we just have to, so, yeah, you know what, I'll just end it right here, I will see you guys next episode, bye!